Hello guys, welcome to How It Started. My name is Farouk Bouhari, aka J Maka, and I am your host for this show. So guys, let me tell you a little bit about How It Started. How It Started is basically a podcast setting where we delve deep into the lives of celebrities to uncover the stories of how they rose to fame. Every week, we will be bringing on your top celebrities to sit down right here with me and give you the stories that led to their success. On this show, we will be having a diverse range of guests, ranging from actors, music artists, comedians. And no matter what their professions are, there is one thing they all have in common. They all have to work out to get to where they are today and they all have stories to tell. Whether it was years of facing countless rejections, honoring their own craft, or taking risks that paid off for them, our guests all have their unique path to fame. And I hope that through our conversations with them, we'll be able to provide insights and good inspirations to people that are also trying to pursue their own dreams. So join me as we sit down with some of the biggest names in entertainment, learn about uh, the highs and lows of their career, lessons they also learned as they were coming up, and also they can give us uh advices they might have for aspiring celebrities people that also want to come up and be like them someone like me i also need those tips to be up there you know so since this show is about telling the viewers about how it started why not let me tell you guys how i also started so it was during the pandemic we were all at home there was nothing to do uh, i was at home with my parents my siblings and that time i was a youtube addict i was always watching youtube like name any youtuber i i know all of them i was a low gang i was a jig polar ksi everything so we are all bored at home nothing to do so in my head i was like let me try doing youtube now since i always watch the youtubers let me try to see if i if i can do anything if i can create any content so i went to meet my dad to see if he would let me do youtube as i was going i was seeking because i was scared so when i got to him me and my brothers we told him wanted to do youtube wanted to vlog he was like are you sure he said yes we can do it he said so what do you want to do do you want to vlog or do you want to create skits or what do you want to do but me since i've been watching vloggers i was like i want to vlog i want to vlog I was like, okay. So he bought a new phone for me, a phone with a very good camera. And we tried vlogging for the first time, me and my brothers. It was it was nonsense because our lives were not interesting at all. Like, we were always at home. So it's, there, there was nothing to vlog, really, because we can't just vlog ourselves sitting down. It was, it, it was just nonsense overall. So one day, my uncle that was also staying with us during the pandemic, told me to cut his hair for him he was always on low cut so it wasn't anything so i was like ah, let, let's make something funny out of this air cut now let me spoil your hair then we we'll record it then we you get now so it was like okay then we thought of something we whipped something up we made a video where i spoiled his hair we showed it to my dad he was like oh now nah, this type of video is good we finished the video. There was no way to edit it. Then my dad started watching YouTube on how to edit. He edited the first video for us. We were like, oh, so we two, we are skit makers now. For like the first five videos, my dad edited them. But me, I wasn't feeling the edit because like he wasn't following the trend of like the new sound effects to use for skits. But me, I was always watching other skit makers hearing the new sound effect. But like it wasn't giving me that vibe so i went to youtube also to learn how to edit some things by myself so the skit journey couldn't continue because i had to go to school the next year so i couldn't do skit again with my brother but there was a time when i came back home i tried another skit with some nollywood actors it was okay but that one was correct setting so that one i wasn't used to it but the ones i used to do with my brother i was the actor director editor everything so i was in charge but now when i have directors directing me do this one do this one but i don't think acting is really my thing but I'll, I'll, I'll still love to do it anyways so with my story of how i started 
it's funny to me because i never had the plans whatsoever to start creating content or do anything related to entertainment but because during the pandemic there was nothing to do and that felt like the only thing to do to keep myself entertained and also try to entertain other people so that's why i want to bring people to this podcast and talk to them about how they started like is this something they had always wanted to do or something that they just had to do maybe because they were bored or just to see how they started because mine is funny to me and some people it might be serious thing maybe it's, it has always been their dream to be on camera show on tvs and stuff so that's the main aim of this podcast how it started where we go beyond the glitz and glamour and uncover the real stories behind the film where we go beyond the glitz and glamour and uncover the real stories behind the film.